Google IT Automation with Python Professional Certificate. What do we know about it? Just by going to its page on Coursera, we can see this. Over 600,000 already enrolled. The average rating is 4.8 out of 5. And it's staffed by Google Career Certificates, which is marked as a top instructor. Looks promising. From what I know, Google courses tend to be popular. But is this certificate worth it today? My name is Daniel, and today we will talk about Google IT Automation with Python Professional Certificate. Who is it for? Certificate structure and completion timeframe, pricing and certification, career opportunities, student reviews. I will offer my own opinion on the certificate's value and its pros and cons. Moreover, guys, I will leave all related links in the description down below, so you will be able to find all necessary information. Let's dive in. Google Certificate Overview Today, barely anyone asks the question of why learn Python. The answer is pretty obvious. Python is one of the most popular programming languages now. Over 50% of all developers worldwide at least once use it for coding. Python is like a Swiss army knife for computer programming. It can do many things, which explains the high demand for people who can use it well. People who are really good at using Python are important in the job world. And knowing Python well can give you lots of job opportunities. Opportunities. I mean, it's easy to see when you go to the biggest job search platforms and type Python in the search bar. Indeed, over 70k listings, Glassdoor over 39k Python related jobs. But to get one of those quoted jobs, you should have the necessary skills. And for that you need to learn, and this is where certificates like this one come in. What is Google IT Automation with Python Professional Certificate? So what is this certificate exactly? Who is it for? And what you can expect from it? Alright, let me explain. The Google IT Automation with Python Professional Certificate is a class made by Google and published it on Coursera. And it's a small part of a big Grow with Google program. That is Google's way of giving people a chance to learn tech skills and find good jobs. Through this program, Google is helping to train top professionals. That's why this certificate is made to give future IT workers important skills like Python, Git and IT automation. These skills can help you do better in your job and move up in your career. It takes what you already know about it and helps you go further. It's meant to show you how to use Python for programming and to make everyday computer tasks easier. You will also discover how to use Git and GitHub, fix tricky problems and make big tasks easier by using special computer setup and the cloud. The Google IT Automation with Python Professional Certificate is designed for beginners. However, don't expect it to teach your coding in Python from scratch. <laughs> Because it shows how Python is used in actual software engineering work, like working with operating systems or handling cloud features. That's why I would personally recommend making sure that you have at least a basic understanding of IT and Python programming before you enroll. And now let's move on to the structure of this program. Certificate structure. Guys, before I move on. Please spare some time to like the video and subscribe to my channel. It's important for the algorithms to boost and help my small channel. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell, so you don't miss my channel updates. Ok, first of all, here is one thing you have to keep in mind. It's not a single course, it's a series of courses. Once you successfully complete them, you will get a professional certificate that will definitely make you more appealing to potential employers. But I will talk about this a bit later. Now let's have a closer look at the certificate structure. Google IT Automation with Python Professional Certificate is made up of six courses. Crash course on Python, using Python to interact with the operating system, introduction to Git and GitHub, troubleshooting and debugging techniques, configuration management and the cloud, and finally automating real-world tasks with Python. As you can see, each class is split into parts that take between 4 and 7 weeks to finish. Each part has videos to watch, things to read and puzzles to do. And there are no strict deadlines. 
You can choose to go through the classes as fast or as slow as you like. All the classes are set up the same way. They start with an introduction and overview, then there are videos to watch, things to read, practice quizzes and final assignments to complete. Each class begins with a welcome reading brief that tells you what you need to know before starting. From what I could see, it's a pretty well-organized program. Looks like it offers a solid understanding of various techniques and how to manage them. Once again, you might struggle with this one if you don't know much about Python programming. So I strongly suggest that you already have some basic experience. You can check out my other Python-related course reviews on this channel. Or just simply get any other course whenever you want. Thank you. How long will it take to complete? I will answer right away. You are expected to spend 6 months on this certificate, provided you spend 10 hours a week learning. But honestly, since you can take all the course at your own pace, it can take even less time. You can learn much faster if you dedicate for example 20-30 hours per week instead of 10, if the curriculum seems easy to you. And now let's talk about prices. Pricing and certification. The Google IT Automation with Python certificate is a part of Coursera's Plus subscription. This means that the program itself is free, but you will have to subscribe to the platform and pay a membership fee to enroll. You can go to Coursera anytime to check out their pricing by yourself in links in the description. Keep in mind that once you pay for your subscription, you get access to lots and lots of other courses, certificates and bootcamps, career opportunities with Google certificate. When you are looking for a job, it's important to have as many proofs as possible to catch the employer's eye. The Google IT Automation with Python certificate will definitely give your potential employer something to talk about during your job interview. Ok, you might ask, but what do I get after I complete this certification program? And I reply with two answers. So the first thing you will get is actual Coursera certificate. And for this you will have to successfully complete each class in the program. And the second thing you will get is the Credly badge. This badge is like a special online award you will get from Google and Coursera. And it's sorted on a website called Credly. Credly is a place where people often show off their skills using certified badges. But will this certificate and badge help you to get a job? And I will tell you this. Mm -mm. No. No. No, no, no! While this is a solid entry-level program, it does not guarantee landing a job. In my opinion, after this certification program, it makes sense to start applying on junior-level positions. And of course, it depends on the company, but you already have chances to get your first job. And definitely you can try internships. Moreover, having a certificate like this behind your belt will 100% make your resume more appealing. Actually, even Google offers some helpful things for finding a job, like a special Coursera job platform. Student reviews. All the courses in the Google Professional Certificate are highly rated. There are no scores lower than 4.6 out of 5, from what I could see. It looks like people like the courses a lot and have good things to say about them. They like the knowledge these courses offer, how the ideas are balanced, real-life examples, clear explanations, short videos that get to the point, and how all these courses relate to real tech jobs. For example, this student left a 5-star review saying, I thought it was a good course, it gives you a good foundation in Python. And this one student said, it was an interesting, amazing and useful set of courses. Through using these courses, I managed to obtain a unique set of skills, such as automating real-world tasks, troubleshooting, debugging techniques and configuration management. However, I found some criticism too. Who is this? For example, this Reddit user says that certificate was all over the place. And to sum up, the stuff you learn in Google IT Automation with Python certificate is very useful for today's IT jobs and making software. Python is the most popular programming language used a lots of real-life projects and areas. If you are completely new to programming, you might find some parts of this course about setting up things and cloud stuff a bit tricky. But if you keep trying, practice and use extra help when you need it, you can get past these challenges and get a lot of out of this certification program. And in my opinion, Google IT Automation with Python certificate is definitely worth it. Yes!
definitely. Guys, I left all certificate related links in the description below. Also, feel free to let me know about your opinion on the Google IT automation with Python certificate in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and till next time.